What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of my, almost said Pokemon then, Legend of Zelda A Link Between Worlds Let's Play. In the first episode we woke up, we left, went to our blacksmith, got a sword, went to deliver it, shit went down, there was a creepy guy and then we got back here again. So, oh my god Ravio, bye now, see you Mr. Hero. Thank you very much Ravio. Let's go to the castle to tell everyone that there's some random guy going around putting people into paintings. But we have a sword now, so we can do whatever the fuck we want here. Yeah. Oh, we broke it. Awesome. Smash some pots. Get ourselves a load of rupees. It seems... Oh, sorry. A uh, little bird, I think it was. Just going to quickly save as well. Because we now have... I need to get the settings up, actually. To change the settings for the speed. Oh, the text. Oh, there's no settings, is there? Brilliant. I don't think there is, at least. Select. Let's equip my items. No, okay. Ah, well. Ah, well, I'll change it at some point. Okay, we need to go to the castle. Um, oh, there's some Ooga Boogas. Ooga Booga. I can't remember the names. Jellos. Are they Jellos or, or something? Wow, there's a load of Jellos around. Beat him up. I'm being a good guy, man. Beating up all the Jellos. Uh, so it's completely the wrong way, so we shall go back because I don't really know what I'm doing down there. I wish you could run almost fast because this isn't quite that fast. Um, I don't know. That's just what I. It's, it's my opinion, guys. Okay, it's my opinion. But let's pop up to the castle here. And before I go in, actually, I'm just gonna pop over here. There's some. There's even more paintings now. Jesus Christ. Uh, I'm gonna go back up to the sanctuary because we did actually miss. Um, there was a. What was it? There was like a door and I didn't go at it because I thought it was the right way to go, but it turned out it was the wrong way, or it was like an extra way, and I, I, me playing games, I need to do 100% on everything. Die B, thank you. Okay, Sanctuary is over this way, and I don't know if the, I guess we'll just go in the secret way, the secret passageway. Seems like the easiest thing to do. Jesus Christ, how many Ugga Boogers are there around? Too many Ugga Boogers for me at least. Oh, what the, no, the bird, the bird! Birds. I hate the birds, man. The birds suck. Okay. Back into the graveyard. Uh, I haven't got my... Oops, no. Select. That's what I need to do. My lantern needs to go my Y. So I have a bit of light here. Let's clear all these. The door should be open already, shouldn't it? No, no door open. Okay, then. Screw you. I'll relight it. Oh, no door is open. Cool. Just couldn't see it. Okay, uh, let's light this. Stupid rats. What the hell did I go out for? Did I hit it with my sword, probably? God damn it. There we are. This is where I need to go. Oh, literally just some rupees, for God's sake. Why didn't I check it last episode? That would be much easier. Okay. And we'll leave now. Because there's nothing else to be done here because we just done it already. But we need to head that down to the castle. Lol, you suck, bird. Can I go this way to the castle? I'm guessing I can. I guess we'll find out though. We cannot. No, damn it. We've got another. Ooga boogers! Oh, an arrow. This isn't. Well. Can I not? <gasps> nope. Not gonna happen. Okay. Okay, we need to get some health back. Gotcha, bird. Such a nice feeling to kill those birds because they really are annoying. Uh, I remember them from um, Phantom Hourglass and Spirit Tracks. I've played both of those games before, though. Both DS games I just didn't get around to playing this one because I, was, I suck. Oh, come on. I thought I could get through him there. I need a heart back, please. Give me a heart. Nope. Blue Rupee, I'll take it, though. Uh, can I get a heart here? Oh, shit, the bird. Yes, get bopped, my friend. But still, there is no heart. Oh my god, I'm, I'm halfway to dead. I'm halfway to dead, my friends. But we're going to go into the uh, it's the castle now. There's no guard anymore because apparently, you know, there's no need for guard now. But we'll get rid of all of this grass and stuff. Just trying to get back to full health. That's the main door. Do you want some help there, dude? There, it's gone. Hey! What? I was helping you out, man. Better watch out there, kid! What? 
What happens if we do this? Ah, they don't, they don't hit me. God damn it! I wanted them to hit me so then I could sue them. There's extra doors everywhere, but... Hello! Whoa! Hold your horses there! Not just anyone gets into the palace. You say the captain was turned into what now? A painting? And Sarah wa Sarah's was too? And Princess Zelda needs to know right away, huh? <laughs> Look, I get you want to see the princess, but that's a real whopper of a story there. My word! What in Hyrule is all the shouting about guard? I'm sorry, Lady Impa. But this lad here has a message for Princess Zelda, and it's as far as far-fetched as it gets. It's that so. What is this message? It's a guy and he's turning people into paintings. Indeed. Sarah's was transformed into a painting, but that's, well, frankly, it's beyond belief. Then again, strange paintings are popping up all over the castle. There may be something to all this. Hmm, yes, I wonder. Quickly, come with me. You've got to tell Princess Zelda what you saw at the sanctuary. Thank you very much. You're taking this boy at his word, Lady Impa? Yep. You just got wrecked, son. Hmm, that's that. Head on in. Lol. You got wrecked, mate. Who's that on the roof? Hmm. There we are. We're in Hyrule Castle. Sup, Lady Impa? Wait here while I announce you to the princess. Feel free to take a look at our gallery here. What, you mean paintings? It's not like this whole game is about paintings, is it? Painting 2, the sealed Triforce. To end the water... Okay, I should really uh, read them from the start, shouldn't I? Kapow, Painting 1. Painting 1, the Golden Triforce. This gift from the gods, Hyrule's greatest treasure, will grant the wish of any mortal who touches it. The Triforce once stoked greed in the hearts of men. A legendary war was fought to keep it out of evil hands. You mean Ganon? Painting 2, the sealed Triforce. To end the war for the Triforce, the royal family decided to hide it in the sacred realm. They summoned the seven sages of legend, who used their power to seal the Triforce away. Not bad. Painting 5. Okay, well that's sort of... Yep, yeah, I don't want to read this bit. It's like spoilers. Spoilers! Is this painting 3 here? Oh, okay, they're on the... See, it's on the floor, man. Painting 3. The Demon King. The Demon King Ganon was once just a thief, until the man broke into the sacred realm. There he stole the Triforce and transformed himself. Then he took his evil campaign back to Hyrule. Oh dear. Painting 4, The Hero Awakens. The hero of legend arose from humble beginnings, awoken to his purpose by a princess of Hyrule. With the master sword, the blade of evil's bane, he sought the descendants of the seven sages. Together they defeated the demon king Ganon and sealed him away in darkness. Powerful. And his Impa. We have to read them all. Damn it. Princess Zelda is ready to see you now. Right this way, please. Does it take me up there? No, it does not. Okay, I can read the last painting properly. Painting 5, the Triforce, split apart. The Triforce was split into three pieces, separated forever. One piece remains with the royal family. Another piece has fallen into the hands of Ganon, sealed away with him. The third piece of the Triforce has vanished, though legend says it is hidden in the spirit of a true hero. It slumbers now somewhere in Hyrule, waiting for the time when the world needs a new hero. You mean like me? Oh yeah! Yeah. Okay, let's go see Princess Zelda. I've got my lance equipped still, whoops. Let's go. What's up, my boy Zelda? Ba -ba -da -da -da. Hello, Zelda. How you doing? What a surprise. I bid you fondest welcome to Hyrule Castle, stranger. I hear you have something to... Wait, it's you! Forgive me, but I ask your name? It's Matt. You know, it's Matt, you know. <laughs> ah, well, your name is unfamiliar to me, Matt. I've seen your face in my dreams of late. <laughs> For I've dreamt of a hero locked in battle with a terrible evil. What? You've had the same dream, Matt? Surely fate has sent you here. Please then, tell me what you saw at the sanctuary. Well, there was this guy and he turned Ceres into a painting, basically. Ceres has been transformed into a painting? The captain as well? I sense a terrible darkness behind these events. Oh, Impa, I feel that evil is awakening once more in our fair land. Fred nod, princess. I advise, I advise that we consult Sahazrala! For help. The elders' knowledge of the past, well, it's more than vast. Yes, of course. That's just where to start. So, Matt, would you please find the Salajla? The elder should be at home in Kakariko Village. Okay, why not? I am certain he'll be able to help. Now, there's just one more thing. I would like to send you off with my most treasured possession. It's a rather special charm. Are you sure about this, Princess? The royal family has kept that safe for untold generations. Quite sure, Lady Impa. 
This has been in my safekeeping since the day I was born. Now I will entrust it to you. Why were you given to it as, as a baby? Yeah, that makes no sense. Please take good care of this charm. You will have need of it soon, Matt. Thank you very much, Zelda. Ba -ba -ba -ba. And it has that symbol on it. I can't remember what the symbol is. Please, tell us has heart everything that you saw. Okay, I think it's the symbol of Ferrore. I'm not sure. Ferrore, one of those. Okay, not going to explore the rest of the castle because castles are boring. Let's go out on the road and see Kakariko Village. I love the Zelda soundtrack. The Zelda soundtrack is one of the best soundtracks in my honest opinion because it's just boss ass. And so it's been up. Oogaboogas. Can I get this piece of heart? It's there. No. It's a hill, you see, and I can't get up the hill. Um, can I get to Kakarino, Kakariko Village? I cannot get to Kakarino Village this way. Actually, I might be able to. If I pop up here and go to the left. And here we are. Ooga Booga's everywhere. Jesus Christ. There's a, there's a fortune teller. That's not who we're going for. Kapow. 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 Let's get rid of all this grass and get ourselves some more rupees. Because rupees are like God. And we're going to need them soon, I'm pretty sure. Or at some point in this game. If we ever need rupees, you can, you know, hit me in the face. Because I'm pretty sure we do. But here we are. Kakariko Village. Let's find Shahajraha. I can't say the name, so I'll just say it the best. Oh, chicken. Everyone knows what chickens do in Zelda. <laughs> wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Come on, chicken, die! Ah! <laughs> Chickens everywhere! Oh shit, it's more. Fight me, chickens! Are you Shahajlaha? No, you're Gramps. And I stop to think how many times we just pass right on by people on our street, you know, all our life. Well, I know a secret that will make passing by people a lot more fun. Because I am in the business of introducing people such as yourself to Street Pass! Oh god. No, later. I don't care about Street Pass. I never have. Bye, chicken! Is this the Shahajrullah's house? It seems to be locked. Someone inside is raising a fuss over what to wear today. How peculiar. It's obviously a woman then. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm not that racist. Not racist, say sex sexist rather. Here we are. It's a weather vane, we shall save our progress here. A new weather vane has been added to the map. We shall save the progress. Since, you know, we're here, why the hell not? Saving has been completed. You've been playing for a while, why not take a break? Ha, 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 no. Pow, screw you, chicken. What's up, dude? Don't be making trouble. I keep the peace in Kakariko Village. Alright, man, you know, just calm down. Is this Shahajaha's house? No, fortune's choice. Who the hell knows what that means? What the hell is this? Milk bar. There's no cows, though. How can there have a milk bar any cows? Weird. Where is Shahajaha's house? It's a chicken farm. What's up, lady? Some naughty child grabbed one of my cuckoos. He probably wanted to jump off a roof of it. Gliding with a cuckoo is fun, but I can't stand it when kids take my cuckoos. Oh dear. It wasn't me. I haven't taken one yet. I just beat one up. <laughs> I can't take it outside with me though. Pow! Bye! Damn it. They just get hit by the door frame. It's not fair. Okay, uh, okay, it's on the map. I could look to the map to see where to go, couldn't I? I forget about the map sometimes. Because I think I'm just too pro. I don't need it. But, oh. Oh, a customer. Don't be shy. Come on over. What's up, brah? That's a heart. If you're feeling weak, that'll get you up and running again. How about 10 rupees for one? No, thank you. Is this a bottle, though? That's a bottle. Used for storing a bunch of things. How about 100 rupees for it? Yes, please. See, guys, we needed rupees for something. So, uh, yeah, you, yeah, you get, don't get to beat me up. I'm sorry. It just, no, it's not, not going to happen, guys. Okay. Uh, yes, it's this house we need here. Let's pop inside. It seems to be locked. Oh, well, that's not very good. This one's not, though. Let's go inside here. Here he is. Sahasrala. This is Oh, oh dear. Doors off again. Consume it! But the look on your face is so grim, Wild. What's the matter? 
Well, Shahazrullah, there's a guy and he's Tony Peel in the paintings. Sarah's was turned into what? A painting? And then she was stolen away? And Princess Zelda sent you here to tell me? I see. This can only be one thing. I'm sure you've heard the legends of old about the Seven Sages and the hero who saved Hyrule. Of course, I just read about them in the museum. Sarah is the descendant of the original Seven Sages who Ganon sealed Ganon in darkness all those years ago. This Yuga you speak of, he must be after the Seven Sages of our day. He surely intends to free Ganon. Oh no! When I heard rumors of a strange man lurking near the Eastern Palace, I sent my people as far to investigate. I've put him in danger, for he's also a descendant of the Seven Sages. I'm sure Yuga will be waiting for him. I'd never make it in time to warn him, but you, Matt, could you hurry to his father and tell him everything? Please! I've made note of the location of the Eastern Palace on your map. You can zoom in and out by using plus and minus, but you may know that already. There's no time to lose. Go now, quickly! Okay, I'll go. We must rescue... Okay, I've forgotten his name. Osfala, that's the one. Zelda names are so funny, aren't they? Osfala. Go away, you booger. I'll grab the heart, though. They don't need it. Because I'm a completionist. But I'm pretty sure I can... No, I have to go back. Yeah, okay. We'll go down to Hyrule Castle, and then... What the fuck's going on? It's a witch. Um, What's going on, witch? That's a bit weird. What's going on with this witch, though? Hmm, interesting. She's a witch, but I can't follow her because she flies, and I can't fly quite yet. I don't think you ever get flying ability in this game, or in any Zelda game, apart from if you've got Cuckoo. Because Cuckoos give you the ability, the magical power, to fly. But guys, while I'm running over here to the Eastern Palace, if you haven't already, be sure to hit that like button if you're enjoying the video, and also you can answer the question there down below in the comment section. Come on, I didn't hit touch him. Which, the question is going to be... Uh, the Zelda series in general, what would you rate it seven? Uh, what would you rate it out of ten? I almost said seven point eight out of ten because of fucking memes. Um, what would you rate it out of ten, guys? If you play it, of course. If you don't play it, let me know and tell me why. Killing all these Zugaburgers and getting rupees everywhere, because that's what I do. Oh, look, there's a whirlpool. Yeah, what's up, dude? Wow, that just that just defied gravity. Do I have to go this way to get up to the? the is it the Eastern Palace rather? <gasps> it's a fairy! I will soothe your wounds and provide comfort. Close your eyes and relax. Yep, I haven't lost any health points, so you know. Might have just wasted that fairy there, but you know. Why is she there? There is no need for her to be there. It's just confusing, man. What's going on? Anyway, let's head up towards the Eastern Palace. Kapow, kapow. Da -da -da -da. What the hell is this? Two orbs, and you need a bow to get inside this doorway. But I don't have a bow! That's a bit of an issue! Awesome. Oh no! Oh no! Get freaking wrecked by me! Yes, mate, you died. Hello, you gonna jump down to me? You step to me, son! If you step to me, I step to you! No, you're not gonna come alive. Okay, I can push you there, can't I? Okay, you could push them in some of the games, but can't in this game, apparently. Anyway, let's go further over to the Eastern Palace and warn Osfala of the fact that he's about to be turned into a painting, pretty much. Is the way inside here? There's a piece of heart, but I can't go anywhere because there's a big drop, so no, the way is not inside here. I know where the way is, so I need to, I need to zoom in here. Pow. Whoa, shit. I was zooming on the map. That's just unfair, dude. That's just unfair. That's where I need to go. There is a stairway there. But da 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 dum da da. Okay, that's actually not helpful at all, is it? So I can't push there. Um, how do I get there? How do I get there? How do I get there? Do I have to actually open? Jesus Christ! Calm down, man. Do I actually have to have a bow to open the door? I believe I do. Oh, go away, man. Go away, you two. Become real. Pop. Pop. Yes, get wrecked. But I'm not going to get extra rupees because I already killed them. Oh dear. Give me a heart. No, that's a rupee. You don't know the difference between hearts and rupees, dude. Come on now. These didn't do anything. And, yeah. I actually need a bow and arrow, don't I? Because I can't do anything with this lantern. 
nothing at all. What do these signs say? Hey, are you the adventuring type? Then I've got items for you. Visit me south of the castle, Ravio. Yeah, I have to go and get a burn hour from Ravio, which is brilliant. That's how this game works in terms of items. You don't get them from the dungeons. You get them actually from buying them from Ravio. So, or renting them rather. Renting and buying from Ravio, so... That's brilliant. A lot of running to and from Ravio. Hopefully you'll get us to teleport in the end. That would be quite nice. But my house is just over here, so that's nice. Not too far to go. I believe this is where my house is. Yes, it is indeed. Die! Yeah, okay, in we go. Let's check out Ravio's shop. Welcome home, Miss Dero. You said it was all right to stay here, so I've made myself at. What happened? Well, you see, he's after the seven sages, basically. What's that? Saw my signs at the Eastern Palace, did you? Okay, maybe not. I was going to open a store near the palace, but when I saw all the monsters, I hightailed it out of there. Way too many monsters around there for my liking, you get me? But I seem to recall some stone pedestals near my signs. Did you see a symbol on them? Oh, you did. Well, do you remember what the symbol was? It was an arrow! Bow and arrow, rather. That's right, it was a bow and arrow! I remind you of anything? Like maybe this? Ba ba da da da! You rented the bow! Don't forget you can aim on the go! Normally I charge you a rental fee, but I'll lend it to you for free. This time anyway. But I'll be taking that back if anything happens to you out there. Okay. Items. Pow! Let's get him on the Y key. Back to the Eastern Palace, my friends! I want to get to Osfala today. Oh. It's the power meter. I think it is, at least. This is the energy gorge. It depletes when you use Ravio's items and recharge over time. If your, run if your energy runs out, you can't use Ravio's items until it replenishes. Try it out, try out using the arrow burn arrow you just got. No thank you. I'm fine. Kapow. No, oh, I don't know if I like the energy meter or not. I preferred it when you just had a certain amount of arrows and shit. But what can you do? It's a game. I don't make the games. They do. Let's go up here. Go away, bird. I don't like you. This guy is getting him away again. Screw him. Screw him. Let's just go and bow an hour up. Pow. We didn't have to charge the bow, do we? And there's the door. It has been opened. Sweet. What's up here, I wonder? Loads of rupees around the edge, apparently, but apart from that, you're gonna turn into. No, you're not. Are you gonna turn into. Yes, you are! Go! Are you gonna turn into. Yes, you are! I can't hear them both at once, which is quite annoying. Are you gonna. No, you're not. What's in the chest? A red rupee! Nice and powerful. Let's just jump off here because we have nowhere else to go. There's another chest there. Well, we can't get there until we have another item. And there's this here, but we need a uh, bomb for that. Spoilers! So let's go inside here. Which I'm assuming is the Eastern Palace. Nope. Can't go in there because the doors are up. Brilliant. Okay. Well, I guess... Let me just zoom in again. So I actually know where I'm going. Okay, that looks better. We can, uh, yeah, we can go along here. Down here, past this little guy here, and we can then get here. Thank you for the blue repeat. And we're almost here. There we are. Once I've beaten these two up. There we are, health back. And we have arrived at the Eastern Palace. Osfala, you! Stop where you are! What are you doing here at the Eastern Palace? I came to warn you, Osfala. Oh, my apologies. I thought you were someone I'm looking for. Aren't you, Matt? You're the blacksmith's apprentice, right? Well, what brings you all the way to Eastern Palace? I've come to save you, dude. You're about to get kidnapped. Vile deeds at the sanctuary? My master sent you to fetch me back to safety? <laughs> this Yugi you speak of, surely he's cause for grave concern. But why should Shahazra be worried about me? I'm a descendant of the original Seven Sages. I'm just as powerful as they were. I even got myself a sand rod, so I'm more or less invincible. Bold talk, you might say, but it's simply the truth. I'll get to the bottom of it, this all, all this Yugi nonsense now. Farewell to you, Matt. Um, Osfala, that's not a good idea. Well, guys, uh, I guess I'm going to save here. And then next episode, we are going to follow Osfala inside the Eastern Palace. Because he's been a bit of a cocky bastard. And he's going to get himself captured. So we better go and save his ass. Even though all we have is a sword and a bow and arrow. But for now, guys, 
This is going to be it for me. If you enjoyed the episode, be sure to hit the like button and answer the question down in the comment section below. I'll be seeing you next time. Thank you for watching. Goodbye, my friend.